just one and a half minutes until uh, the issuance of uh, the undocking command. A great view uh, as the International Space Station flies over China. On the left is the orbital ATK Cygnus craft that arrived at the International Space Station just a week ago. In the middle, there's your Soyuz MS-01 spacecraft, uh, currently docked uh, to the Rosviet module. On the right, at the bottom of your screen, the ISS Progress 64 cargo craft that arrived at the station back in July and which will remain attached to the station until the end of January. Station now flying over southern Mongolia and we have undocking. SSVP mode. Undocking confirmed at 7.35 p.m. Central Time. On the cusp of the 16th anniversary of a permanent human occupancy in space, the 50th expedition to the International Space Station is officially underway. CS ready. BVS ready. The uh, first separation burn, an eight-second burn that will increase uh, the opening rate by about five-tenths of a meter per second now underway. And sending A11. Activating aero deca. Copy. Command has been sent. And a good view of the uh, manual test being performed by Anatoly Ivanishin. A test of uh, a pair of hand controllers on board uh, Soyuz to characterize the controllability of the new Soyuz MS thruster configuration. Has been activated. Affirmative. Breathtaking view as uh, the Soyuz flies over northeastern China. About to cross the uh, border on the far eastern uh, side of Russia. This view uh, scintillating of. Uh, the Soyuz flying away from the International Space Station through the High Definition External Viewer Camera, or HDEV, moving from northwest to southeast at an altitude of 252 miles above the Earth over the Northwest Pacific Ocean. Thirty seconds, standing by. Unintelligible. And there is our view, uh, our first view of the Soyuz MS-01 spacecraft under uh, its large orange and white uh, main parachute. We can confirm. You saw just a moment ago the heat shield being uh, deployed. That uh, enables uh, the base of the bottom of the Soyuz with its altimeter and soft landing engines uh, to be exposed. The altimeter uh, providing uh, altitude and rate of descent information to the onboard computers for the firing of the soft landing engines just a second or two before touchdown. Standing by for touchdown. Touchdown confirmed at 10.58 p.m. Central Time, 11.58 p.m. Eastern Time, 9.58 a.m. in Kazakhstan on Sunday morning. Be careful. Very careful. <laughs> this way. Are you ready? Is everybody ready? Be careful. Flashing that uh, familiar smile that we have seen so often during her four months in space. Kate Rubin's now out of the Soyuz spacecraft, all three crew members out. Kate, welcome back. You're looking good. Hey! Doing good. Far better than expected. What do you need right now? You can sit here and enjoy the Earth. <laughs> Thank you.